The observable universe has long been a realm of mystery and wonder for humanity, captivating the minds of ancient civilizations. As far back as the earliest records of human history, we have craned our necks toward the skies, yearning to understand what lies beyond the confines of our small planet. This fascination, driven by our innate curiosity, has only deepened over the centuries. For ages, the edge of the observable universe has represented the ultimate frontier, a boundary not just of distance but also of knowledge, comprehension, and understanding itself. Today, however, we stand on the precipice of a new era. The James Webb Space Telescope, humanity's most advanced tool for peering into the cosmos, has brought us closer than ever before to unlocking the profound mysteries that lie at the very edge of this boundary. With its revolutionary technology and unparalleled sensitivity, it has become our eye to the distant universe, providing us with images and data that challenge the very fabric of our understanding of space, time, and existence. But what, exactly, lies at the very edge of the observable universe? Is it a cosmic curtain, an impenetrable boundary that hides untold secrets, or is it something far more complex and unexpected? What we know today is only a glimpse into what might be, but Webb's remarkable discoveries have set the stage for humanity to reimagine everything we thought we knew about the universe. To comprehend these monumental revelations, we must first understand what we mean by the observable universe. The observable universe is not a physical entity or a single structure, it is a region defined by the limitations of light and time. The universe, possibly infinite in its true nature, is constrained by the speed at which light can travel, and the finite age of the cosmos, which is approximately 13.8 billion years. The farthest light we can see comes from objects that are about 46.5 billion light years away, farther than we could have imagined in earlier centuries. This spherical boundary, which encompasses everything we can observe, marks the limit of our current understanding and comprehension of the cosmos. Beyond this boundary lies the unknown, a vast and enigmatic expanse that has remained largely out of reach. Yet imagine a telescope so powerful that it could pierce the deepest regions of space, capturing faint signals and primordial light from galaxies formed mere millions of years after the Big Bang. This is exactly what the James Webb Space Telescope was designed to do, and in doing so, it has unlocked a new chapter in the story of the universe. The James Webb Space Telescope, with its advanced infrared capabilities, is designed to peer through the cosmic dust and unveil the hidden wonders of the universe. Its mission to explore the earliest moments of the universe and push the boundaries of our knowledge has already begun to revolutionize our understanding of cosmic history. Webb's ability to detect light that has traveled across unimaginable distances has opened a new window into the infancy of the cosmos, revealing galaxies that existed when the universe was a mere fraction of its current age. What Webb has uncovered at these extreme distances is nothing short of astonishing. At the very edge of the observable universe, Webb has detected light from galaxies that date back over 13 billion years, some of the first structures to form in the aftermath of the Big Bang. These ancient galaxies, though distant, provide a unique window into the early universe, revealing the forces and processes that helped shape the cosmos we know today. But Webb's findings do not merely confirm our theories, they challenge them. For example, the telescope has detected galaxies that are far larger and more evolved than they should be given their age. How could these massive systems have formed so quickly, just a few hundred million years after the Big Bang? This unexpected discovery forces astronomers to reconsider our models of galaxy formation and evolution, prompting new questions about how the universe progressed during its earliest stages. Webb's discoveries are not limited to galaxies alone. The telescope has also captured the faint glow of the cosmic microwave background radiation, the ancient afterglow of the Big Bang itself. This radiation, the oldest light in the universe, carries invaluable information about the conditions of the early cosmos. 
By studying this faint signal, scientists have been able to refine their measurements of the universe's expansion rate, known as the Hubble constant, and even speculate about the mysterious force driving this expansion, dark energy. Yet, as Webb ventured deeper into the cosmos, it began to encounter the limits of what even its highly advanced instruments could detect. These limits were not just technological but also fundamental. The universe itself imposes a boundary on what we can observe, the cosmic event horizon. Beyond this horizon, light from distant objects cannot reach us, no matter how long we wait. This boundary, defined by the speed of light, and the expansion of space itself, is where Webb's gaze meets the edge of the observable universe. So, what lies beyond this boundary? While the cosmic event horizon represents the ultimate limit of our observational capabilities, it is not a physical barrier. It is defined by the relentless expansion of the universe and the finite speed of light. Objects beyond this horizon are receding from us faster than the speed of light, and as space itself stretches, their light can never reach us. But does this mean that nothing exists beyond the observable universe? Certainly not. Many scientists believe that the universe extends far beyond the edge of what we can observe, perhaps even infinitely. However, this remains speculative, as there is no way to directly observe this distant realm. Yet Webb's observations near this boundary have provided tantalizing clues about what might lie beyond. For example, the distribution of galaxies at the edge of the observable universe suggests that the vast cosmic web of galaxies, clusters, and voids likely extends far beyond what we can detect. These patterns align with the cosmological principle, a foundational idea in cosmology that suggests the universe is homogeneous and isotropic on the largest scales. But Webb's discoveries have also uncovered peculiar anomalies that have left scientists intrigued and puzzled. In certain regions near the edge, there are unexpected fluctuations in temperature and density in the cosmic microwave background. Could these anomalies point to unknown structures, or even to interactions with other universes? Yes, you read that correctly, the idea of a multiverse, our universe being just one of many, has gained traction among some theorists. If true, these other universes might have entirely different laws of physics, different dimensions, and different compositions. While Webb's findings don't confirm this hypothesis, they have opened a door to discussions that challenge the boundaries of both science and philosophy. Perhaps most astonishing of all, Webb has detected ultra-distant quasars and massive black holes at the edge of the observable universe. These enigmatic objects, powered by supermassive black holes, shine with an intensity that defies belief. Their presence at such extreme distances raises profound questions, how did these black holes grow so rapidly in the young universe? Could their formation and behavior offer clues about what lies beyond the cosmic horizon? And then, of course, there is the mystery of dark energy, the elusive force accelerating the expansion of the universe. Webb's observations suggest that dark energy may not be uniform across the cosmos. In some regions near the observable edge, subtle variations in dark energy hint at the presence of unknown forces shaping the universe in ways we cannot yet fully comprehend. Could dark energy itself be a bridge to understanding what lies beyond our observational limits? In its exploration of the universe's edge, the James Webb Space Telescope has not only deepened our understanding of the cosmos, but also forced us to confront fundamental questions about the very nature of reality. The data Webb has provided is more than just a series of discoveries, it is a glimpse into the future of science, philosophy, and human knowledge. It challenges us to rethink our place in the universe and to confront the possibility that much of the cosmos remains forever beyond our reach. Yet even as Webb uncovers the deepest recesses of space, it leaves us with more questions than answers. This is perhaps the greatest lesson of all, that the pursuit of knowledge is a never-ending journey. 
As we peer into the farthest reaches of the observable universe, we are reminded that the edge is not the end. It is just the beginning. The mysteries that lie beyond may remain beyond our grasp for now, but thanks to tools like web, we are better equipped than ever to explore and question the cosmos. As we continue to push the boundaries of exploration, one thing is certain, the universe is an endless source of wonder, full of stories waiting to be discovered